true. It's one of our problems with metrics is they're not aligned. But there's a couple of other problems with metrics. So what about this whole idea of unintended consequences? How do metrics drive unintended consequences, potentially? Thoughts? So if you have the wrong metric, what could, how could it drive the wrong thing? Any sense? American Airlines? I'm going to pick a, a non-Canadian airline. American Airlines. You remember when all the US airlines, or even some of the Canadian airlines at, at one point went bankrupt, or filed for bankruptcy reorganization? There was a really, really dark time. Well, what did American Airlines do after reorganization? Do any of you know the story? So the executives in charge had this great idea that said, we're going to put metrics on our pilots. And we're going to say, for every million dollars you save in fuel costs, we'll bonus a percentage of it back to you. Now, if I'm sitting there as the pilot, what am I going to do? Figure out a darn way that I'm going to save on my fuel costs. What do you think that started happening? What? No, not safety issues. I don't, well, at least not that we know of. They started canceling flights. So what, if the, the flight wasn't full enough, they would make up some story about maintenance, and this is now proven, they would cancel the flight. So what happens? They got their bonus. What was the long-term effect? Pissed off their customers, did it not? And started going to the others. Unintended consequences. So let's, let's take a look at this. This is from some SHRM site. Recruiting metrics are standards of measurement utilized by HR professionals and recruiters in order to gather, assess, and present information analysis with the hiring process. What do you think of the definition? This is not Jerry's definition. Jerry's is much better, by the way. But this is online right now. It's as of a couple of days ago. What do you think of that definition about metrics? Does it tell you anything? How would you change it? What are metrics in your mind? What's that? It's a tool. Define it for me. To measure a process. Keep going. Quality, performance, time, maybe. Effectiveness, results, ROI. Ooh, who said that? ROI. Very, very good. What else? What else is it used for? Behav Ooh, ROI and behavior. Tell me about the behavior thing. It's what they're choosing to do, or is it what we're telling them to do? They're being guided by metrics to do certain things. Every metric you use on your recruiters or on yourself, ultimately edits the behavior that you're doing. Unintended consequences. So it can be a negative. It could also be a positive.